Hello everybody, and welcome to the Galveston College Library Short on how to request library instruction for your courses. My name is Andrew Vierkant, librarian at Galveston College, and I am happy to be here with you today to walk you through the process of requesting library instruction and what all it entails for your classes. In order to locate the information and request form pages, we'll want to start from the GC homepage. To find the library page, you'll head up to this header, find the Students tab, and in the bottom right-hand corner will be a link to the library. In addition, at the very bottom of the page in this link tree, you'll find an additional link to the library. From the Libraries page, you'll want to select the Information Literacy and Library Instruction tab on the running header. Alternatively, you can select the For Faculty tab, and under Information Literacy and Library Instruction here on the left-hand side, you'll be able to access our document. Now, why utilize library instruction? The GC Library's stated goal for our instruction programming is to provide as many students an introduction to information literacy as possible in order to bolster their success inside and out of the classroom. We believe that library instruction is key in introducing students to the library and developing research skills. The skills that are acquired by students following library instruction align with the Association of College and Research Libraries Framework for Information Literacy Competency Standards for Higher Education. These contain the ability to better identify library resources, demonstrate knowledge of the research process, evaluate the quality and credibility of information sources, and to help prevent plagiarism. Now what library instruction is offered? The GC Library offers multiple avenues of instruction for everyone's convenience and ease of access. We offer self-paced DIY information literacy tutorials, in addition to individual research appointments, online instruction webinars, and research guides, which can be integrated into Canvas. For this video, we will be focusing on the synchronous sessions offered online through the library, our in-class instruction sessions, and our embedded librarian program. How to register for library instruction. Selecting the Request Library Instruction tab will take you directly to the request form. By filling out this request form, the librarians will be able to better prepare for your classroom instruction and tailor the session for your particular research assignment. After the library receives your form, you'll be reached out to in order to finalize this instructional session. To begin, you will want to double check the request policies to make sure you have the proper documentation and are following the correct procedure to ensure a seamless request. We will need some boilerplate information at first, name, email, instructor phone, department and course number, and the expected number of students who will be in attendance. You will have the option to choose in-person class instruction, live virtual instruction over WebEx or Teams, instruction modules which can be embedded directly into Canvas, or the option to embed a librarian virtually into your course on Canvas. These choices will factor into how you choose your student's method of receiving credit as well. Specifically, for our modules, you can choose to make them graded assignments or extra credit assignments. For in-person classes, you'll need to select the room number, date, and time you want to request this instructional session. Keep in mind, according to policy, you'll need to submit the request at least two weeks before the class starts. For the research modules, we have multiple options along with quizzes that can be imported directly into Canvas for your class. These include instructions on database searching, different citation styles, plagiarism, research help, as well as an orientation of the library itself. Finally, include research assignment instructions or upload a copy of the research assignment for the librarians to review prior to your class. This is an essential part of the process as it allows us to better prepare ahead of time to serve your students in the best way possible. At the end of the document, you will also find an area to include any additional questions, comments, or requests for the librarians to review before reaching out to you to finalize your instructional session. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this library short over the request process for library instruction. If you enjoyed this video and feel that it was helpful, please feel free to share it with your peers, leave us a like, and let us know in the comments section if you have any questions or advice on our library shorts moving forward. From all of us here at the GC Library, thank you again, and have a great day.